गुड इवनिंग ऑल ऑफ द स्टूडेंट्स आई एम प्रोफेसर उत्कर्ष निगम असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर इन द डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ सिविल इंजीनियरिंग एल डी कॉलेज ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग अहमदाबाद एंड फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल बिफोर आई प्रोसीड आई विल रिक्वेस्ट यू दैट काइंडली टेक केयर ऑफ योर सेल्फ प्लीज स्टे एट योर होम एंड द ओनली वे टू फाइट विद दिस कोरोना कोविड नाइन्टीन इज दैट यू हैव टू कीप योर सेल्फ अलोन एंड क्वारंटाइन and uh, please follow the practice of self quarantine and now we shall proceed towards our subject the civil engineering societal and global impact this is uh, this comes under the part of gtu the fourth semester subject and uh, there is a powerpoint presentation that i will deal with uh, uh, step by step in the sessions there will be total three video lectures there are total six modules in which 50% of that has to be dealt by me and 50% will be dealt by applied mechanics department so these three modules i shall try to cover in these three video lectures this is the the first video lecture uh, which uh, i will give on the module number 2 that is uh, civil engineering importance ancient and uh, modern uh, marvels and wonders of the civil engineering also we shall discuss about the futuristic vision of the civil engineering as well so before i start uh, as we all know uh, about the teaching scheme about the gtu syllabus uh, but uh, first of all we need to understand what is civil engineering and what uh, civil engineer does that is a very important part uh, we need to understand it and why this subject has been introduced in our uh, curriculum in the fourth semester uh, just uh, to cop up the requirement uh, and uh, the needs of the environment uh, now Uh, let's proceed towards the presentation of this module number 2 civil engineering societal and global impact this uh, module deals uh, with the ancient and modern marvels of the civil engineering how the structures have been constructed from the years and ages and how the structures are being constructed nowadays and what what are the futuristic approaches of the civil engineering that we shall study in this module but before we shall proceed we will take a glance at the gtu syllabus and its teaching scheme as we all know the two lectures per week is in the teaching scheme and uh, the examination will be of the 70 plus 30 marks will be the internal and 70 will be the university exams and this is actually the syllabus of the gtu uh, total six modules are there uh, and uh, in this six modules i am dealing with the 50% of the portion and 50% of the portion is being dealt by the applied mechanics department of our institute and the module number 2 module number 3 and module number 6 these are the three modules in which i will give my contribution uh, towards the completion of the syllabus these are the course outcomes that uh, what uh, an any of the student uh, will be able to achieve or what uh, he will be he or she will be able to learn or understand about the concepts of global and societal impact of the civil engineering uh, with reference to the global with reference to the local and with respect to the modern concern of this but per particularly in this we shall discuss about the modern and ancient civil engineering marvels the structures the monuments the sculptures and the futuristic vision of the civil engineering as well so this is the content draft of my portion that i have told that i shall deal with the module number 2 module number 3 and module number 6 the module 2 is basically uh, dealt with the understanding of the civil engineering importance and the ancient and modern marvels and wonders in the field of civil engineering and futuristic vision of the civil engineering today in this lecture we shall confined towards this uh, module number 2 itself uh, in the upcoming video lecture we shall also study the module number 3 which is related with the infrastructures futuristic systems uh the hydro power generation energy generations and uh, various codes and sustainability aspects which is uh, in the module number 3 and uh, also uh, one video that i shall upload later on on the module number 6 that is the civil engineering projects environment impact assessment techniques for the reduction of the greenhouse gases contribution of the civil engineering to the gdp the contributions Uh, to the employment uh, quality of the product health and safety and innovations and methodologies for ensuring the sustainability during the product 
project development so that also uh, there will be the three separate videos today in today's video we shall study about module number two uh, that is related with the importance of civil engineering the module number three that we shall uh, prepare a next and separate video and module number six will also be uh, completed in separate video so there will be total three videos in which the ppt will be explained by me in the in all the sessions so uh, we shall begin with the module number two civil engineering marvels ancient and modern what is the importance of civil engineering that also we shall study this is the subtopic outline and details uh, that is civil engineering for the society importance of the civil engineering understanding the importance of civil engineering different type of structures in civil engineering ancient and modern marvels and wonders and future vision of the civil engineering first of all we shall understand uh, about the civil engineering and how it is important for the society as we know the civil engineering is the engineering discipline that deals with the design construction and maintenance of public works such as building roads bridges water energy system as well as public facilities like ports railways airports transportation and various other facilities are also uh, included in the civil engineering and civil engineering is all about the people it's the work that civil engineers do to develop and improve the services and facilities that general people use in their every day life so that is its importance uh, in the society the importance of civil engineering in the development is that civil engineering has played a vital role in increasing the health and quality of life from developing infrastructures the better water supply municipal severe systems wastewater treatment plants to the design of buildings to protect us from the natural hazards and provide health care to improve agriculture through water resource development and distribution project to rapid and dramatic changes in transportation system civil engineers had developed the basic infrastructure on which modern society depends so that is actually the importance of civil engineering in the development of a society now understanding the importance in shaping and impacting the world so as you all know that uh, civil engineering has its own importance uh, as far as construction industry is concerned as far as infrastructure development is concerned as far as the day to day life and uh, public facilities are concerned as far as transportation facilities are concerned sewerage and water supply designings uh, these are concerned so civil engineering helps in uh, connecting or bridging the gap between the uh, public and day to day life and also uh, the construction and development of hydraulic structures the water networks uh, the transportation networks that also included in this so therefore civil engineering has its own importance and it is very much essential for the societal public and nations development different types of uh, civil engineering structures we all know that building structures aqueduct viaduct bridges canals water supply lines uh, water supply networks drainage and storm networks uh, cooling towers chimneys hydraulic structures dams railways transportation facilities roads retaining walls slopes stability of slopes tunnels coastal defenses these are the various structures and many more structures are also being constructed but all those can be uh, grouped under the uh, mentioned outline of this uh, uh, slide the ancient and modern marvels and wonders in the field of civil engineering as far as uh, the civilization is concerned uh, there have been lots of uh, marvels and wonders of the civil engineering and these are the examples of uh, astonishing and brilliance uh, of uh, civil engineering uh, from the past era and uh, from where the civilization has actually uh, begun so there are various civil engineering marvels in which asc has also honored some of the uh, what we can say is, uh, some of the structures are concerned so these are few structures which are being concerned ancient marvels versus modern marvels so on the left hand side you can see there are few uh, list of uh, ancient wonders ancient marvels and on the right side there is there are mod modern marvels are are given 
uh, and mentioned in this slide and uh, you can go and the students are actually instructed to go through these marvels that uh, uh, which type of materials were constructed what was the, was the type of soil and uh, what were the actually problem uh, problems and what were the reasons to construct those uh, uh, marvels or those wonders and uh, whether it is a modern marvel or whether it is an ancient marvel why these were constructed so actually it is uh, being converted this particular uh, topic has been converted as an assignment part for the students so that they will get more exploration of these topics so future vision for the civil engineering in the futuristic development of the nation for the betterment of livelihood and sustainability. Construction of different infrastructures and buildings that give services for the public use. The civil engineer has the responsibility of undertaking preliminary studies of the possible plans leading to a futuristic recommended scheme. Because any of the scheme, any of the plan uh, which will be implemented in the future or which will be planned today and will serve in the next uh, 20 to 30 years or maybe till 50 years. So that has to be sustainable as well. So that can be included in the vision of civil engineering and to efficiently mandate of prop preparing contract documents of civil engineering project that is also important aspect of civil engineering most important aspect is more than one third of the wealth creation of the globe is from the construction industry and construction industry is directly related with the civil engineering so it has its uh, importance its own importance and dignity as well shaping the construction industry by employing advanced techniques and equipments the construction industry is the largest um, employer of main power. So uh, that's why the advanced techniques, advanced equipments uh, are being required in shaping the construction industry and its use and uh, its utilization applications has to be studied. And uh, these are actually the future vision for the civil engineering. These are a few references for this topic. In this module, we have uh, gone through uh, various uh, ancient modern marvels the importance of civil engineering and subsections and if you really have a query related to this module number two or you are not able to understand any of the topic uh, although this topic has been already covered in the lecture as well I have given the lecture notes lecture sheets of this uh, this PPT also I will float within the classroom and you just go through all each and every part of this and uh, uh, if you have any query you can uh, put a comment to me on my personal number as well or if you want to uh, discuss anything you may uh, call also and thank you very much and uh, in this uh, time uh, of uh, COVID-19 corona fight which we all uh, citizens of this country are currently going through so it is a request to keep yourself at home stay at home and stay safe and the only way to fight with uh, COVID-19 is just to stay safe and stay at the home. Thank you very much.